Okay, in this problem we're asked to sketch the region R and give an iterated integral that evaluates the double integral of our function f of x, y over the region R. And then we're asked to evaluate that iterated integral. So we're given that f of x, y is the function x plus y. And our region R is determined by x being between negative 1 and 1 and y ranging from 1 to 2. So if we go ahead and sketch our region R, so we want our x values to range from negative 1 to 1. So we're looking at values between negative 1 and 1. And then we're looking at y values that range from 1 to 2. So all values of x between 1 and 2, and, but our constraints of x are from negative 1 to 1. So we have constraint like that, and then we also have our constraint of y's. So we're looking at the area in which those two regions intersect, and that's this rectangle here. So our region R is this rectangle that is in the first and the second quadrants. And so we want to now calculate an or determine an iterated integral that will calculate the double integral of f of x, y over this region R. So first we can plug in our information that we know right away, which is our function f of x, y. So we have a double integral of x plus y, and we want to calculate it over our region R. So um, it looks like we want, so we want to vary our y's from 1 to 2. So if we calculate dy first, we'll get the integral from 1 to 2. But then we want to look at just x values, or we want to look at the integral from 1 to 2 only when x ranges from negative 1 to 1. So that means we also calculate the integral from, of dx from negative 1 to 1. So we're taking at x equals negative 1, the integral from 1 to 2, and kind of sweeping that through and calculating all the way up to the integral uh, when x is equal to 1 we're calculating the integral from 1 to 2. So that's given by our, double, our iterated integral. Um, so now we want to evaluate this iterated integral. So we can do that by splitting up our two integrals. So first we want to calculate the interior one, and that's the integral from 1 to 2 of x plus y dy. So our outside integral remains the same. The integral of x dy is xy. And the integral of y dy is y squared over 2. And then we want to evaluate this for y values between 1 and 2. So we can go ahead and do that. When y is equal to 2, we get two x plus two. So two x plus four squared or four over two, which is two. And then we'll subtract when y is equal to 1, 
So that's minus x plus 1 half. So 2x minus x is x. So we have the integral from negative 1 to 1 of x plus 3 halves, which is 2 minus 1 half dx. So now we can just calculate this integral in the normal way. Integral of x is x squared over 2. plus 3 halves x, and, and we'll evaluate that from negative 1 to 1. So we can go ahead and do that. When x is 1, we get 1 half plus 3 halves minus the quantity 1 half minus 3 halves. So 1 half minus 1 half is 0. 3 halves minus a negative 3 halves is plus 3 halves. 6 halves, which is 3. So we were given our region R. We sketched it. And then we used that to calculate a double integral of our function f of x, y over that region R, and we determine that the double integral evaluates to 3.